How to create virtual environment using virtual env and install python modules. We need a tool to install python packages. Here we can use pip. pip is a tool for installing python packages. If you are using Ubuntu or Debian machine, you can use apt-get command to install pip. If you are using Fedora or CentOS, you can use the yum command. If you are using Windows system, you need to download this getpip.py file, then install that file using python python get pip dot py so he, i am using ubuntu system so let me install pip okay so in my machine i already installed python pip next we need to install virtual env tool so this tool will help us to create the virtual environment so we can use the pip come pip tool to install virtual env module so sudo pip install virtual env Okay, that's done. So we installed pip, then we installed virtual env using that pip tool. Okay, then I am going to create a virtual environment using this virtual env tool. So we can use this command virtual env, then name of the environment. PNV. So this will create a folder named VNV. So let me check what is inside that folder. LS VNV. You can see four directories inside that VNV folder. One bin bin folder then include lib and packages lib and local so the packages whatever we whatever we installed will go into this folder that I will show so in, inside this folder, this bin folder, you can see a couple of script uh, like activate, then activate e easy install. So we can use this activate script to activate this virtual environment. So let me activate this virtual environment. So it's vnv bin activate so i activated the environment so here you can see the name of the environment this means the environment is activated
so i already exp explained this how to activate the virtual environment let me show one more thing let me go to the virtual environment folder in this folder you can see one lib folder inside that lib folder let me go to that lib folder lib python 2.7 then you can see the site packages so inside this folder you can see the setup tools lot of pip some packages you can see so what are the packages we install inside this virtual environment will go into this site package directory okay so let me go back then the next what I am going to show is how to install python modules into this virtual environment so there are different methods the first method is use pip use pip tool to install python module like pip pip install then name of the module you want to install for example net addr so it's installed net addr package so let me check that if you go to site packages directory ls then the site packages you can see the net addr net addr see here that's the method one this way you can install any module then the method to download a source code of the project then go to the download directory then run setup.py install so i will show you how to do this first download i am going to download the source source code of this python keystone client project from this github.com from here we can copy the URL then go to the terminal and do git clone so you have to install this git git tool so I already installed it See it's downloading after that I will go to the Python keystone client folder then I will run python setup.py install this python setup.py install command this command will install this python keystone client into the virtual environment because that virtual environment is active, active. CI is clone then go to clone directory inside that clone directory you can see the setup.py file so let me run it python setup.py then the argument then the option install so this will install C 
so it, you can see it, it will install the dependencies dependencies of the clone project Python uh, Python client okay it's done so let me check the site packages directory there you can see a lot of packages because these are the dependencies dependencies of uh, keystone client so here you can see the keystone client then all other things are dependencies that's a method 2 let me move to the method 3 here we can, what I'm going to show is first download the source code of the project in tar or uh, zip file format then extract it then go to the extracted folder then run the same command uh, like this uh, setup.py install so let me find a tar file so if we go to the releases there you can from there you can download the uh, this package in support tar.gz format let me copy the URL then do W get okay it's downloaded here you can see the tar.gz file let me extract it tar minus xzf so it's extracted then go to the extracted folder then run here you can see the setup.py file then run python setup.py install so if you are getting error like this just do git init then try setup.py install again installed so this way you can install a python packages into your system